When I was three, I asked my parents for piano lessons and they were skeptical. By the time I was six or seven, I, I had actually written something that was legitimate. It wasn't fantastic, but I was six. At the age of 12, I wrote a work that was performed in front of an audience of several thousand. I'm Josh Archibald Cipher. I'm 20 years old. I'm a music major with a concentration in composition. I guess one of the biggest reasons that I came to Stanford instead of uh, a conservatory was there was still a very strong emphasis on having kind of an overall college experience. I think it was Arthur Rubinstein who said that, you know, never practice more than three hours a day because otherwise you're not, you're not outside and you don't have anything from the outer world to bring to what you do. I've really found that Stanford is a place that uh, you get out of it, what you put into it. During the fall of my sophomore year, um, I saw an email come out asking for a rehearsal pianist for a production of The Wiz. I sent them an email. I said, you know, I'd be interested. I'd, I'd like to be involved. And they said, that's great. Would you also like to be our music director? We don't have one. I had never touched a conductor's baton in my life. This show sold out every performance that it had. I'm really glad that it was something that I could try my hand at. When I'm writing music, I always like to start out doing just sketches, pencil on paper. It's a very modest sort of connection, I guess, with the music. I've recorded four CDs professionally. Currently, I would say that my music is, oh, let me see, a little bit tricky. Tricky. Well, no, I don't know that I'd just say it's straight up tricky. Let me just think for a sec. A little thorny, but not completely inaccessible. In terms of fitting into a sense of community, um, I have found that at Stanford in a way that I did not before. The university provides a lot of funds to help support student arts projects. It makes students, I think, want to really commit themselves and really want to dive into projects that they are passionate about. Stanford has allowed me to do that. I'm incredibly grateful to uh, this scholarship fund to the university for providing me with uh, the financial aid to, to be here at Stanford and to do these incredible things.